Hi folks, a little bit delayed, a short video about the new functions in our latest release, Autodesk Shape Modeling plugin for Rhino. With the new command Surface Fillet, you can select two sets of surfaces that don't have to be connected to fillet them with a specified radius and other various options. The Smooth function allows you to select a surface and then rearranges its control points to achieve a better layout. You can optionally choose to keep the position or the tangency of the edges using the right mouse button on the corresponding handles in the graphics area. As you can see, the needed control points for that continuity keep their position then. With the sliders you can control how much you want to smooth the surface. You also have an integrated analysis to measure the resulting deviation from the original surface. In the Analysis toolbar, the new Analysis Shaded Deviation is available. It displays the deviation from an object to a reference using colors, allowing you to directly see if your object is below or above the target. The Curve Sketching function has also been enhanced. When you stop sketching, you can select existing curves, which are then treated like freshly sketched curves. In addition, you can now also move the connected endpoints of curves. This way you can create a curve net on your reference, if needed in several steps, moving endpoints and tweaking the shape by using the oversketch option. To build surfaces from curve nets, created like this or in another way, the function surfaces from curve net has been introduced. It uses the multi-blend algorithm to fill a network of curves with surfaces. This plugin and our real-time renderer for Rhino are available with a up to 72% discount until 7th of March. For a complete list of enhancements and new functions, please read the description. You can download a test version with a 2 months license from www.virtualshape.com. Thank you for watching.